Okay, so we've done our scalp brush therapy, we've done our scalp cleanser, and we've now also done our scalp tonic. Now it's time to finish off the hair and look after the hair. The tonic must always go before the shampoo and conditioner because as we're rinsing it out, the pH isn't right for the hair and we need to go in and start closing the cuticle. So the tonic always before the shampoo and conditioner. So remember, we're on a timer here and you gotta choose the right shampoo for your hair. So the scalp cleanser, when it runs through the hair, it's really cleaning anything that could be fake. You know, a lot of these shampoos have silicones and things and they build up in the hair. The scalp plans are really clean. So we're going to use a real prescriptive shampoo. I'm using a moisture product here between both hands, okay? And we're not going to touch it anywhere near the scalp. We're going to keep it 10 centimeters off the scalp. So it's what I call ponytail, okay? So you just grab the ponytail or we say mid lengths and ends. So all I'm doing is just squeezing it through. Okay, most shampoos these days um, have foaming agents in them, so you can sort of feel that they're you know, working straight away. And it should, if it's the right shampoo for you, make your hair feel a little bit soft straight away. So I can feel that this moisture shampoo is the right one for this hair type. Okay, we only need one shampoo because we're not cleaning the hair. The hair's already clean from the scalp cleanser. We're actually starting to moisturize and close the cuticle. So we'll rinse this out. 